Hey guys, Greenbolt here and welcome to the second episode of Gundam Breakers 3. In this episode we continue our mission and we also mod our Gundams and get some interesting weapons. I would also like to take the time to also apologise for the long break. Things took a lot longer than expected to get my setup up and running. I managed to get everything working now. Um, there will be no pack opening for the PC TGO players or Pokemon trading card game players, but there will be one next week, I promise. Um, you might be asking what I've upgraded. Essentially, I've scrapped my old hardware and bought completely new hardware. So I've got a new machine, uh, which is a beast, uh, new mic, new monitor, new software. Uh, if you want me to do a breakdown, let me know. I could do a video on it. I could show you how to kind of tune all the stuff so it does get it all up and running. Fortunately, I work in IT uh, professionally, so it was quite challenging and also quite fun to do. Also, um, since I've been away, I've noticed I've got 60 subs. That's brilliant. I know I haven't been putting out a lot of content, but I'm looking to jump back on the train and start getting some stuff out there. Um, so I'd like to thank all the subs. Um, so... Well, essentially, that's pretty much it. Let's not waste any time. I know you guys have been gagging for it, so let's just jump in and build our Gundam and cause some carnage. Okay, so I think we're on mission three last time we left off, and I think we're on mission four. Yep, there we go. Uh, mission four, so who do... Oh, probably for those guys who just joined in, not aware. Uh, this is Gundam Breaker 3. So I recommend watching the first episode because there's a, a lot that's going on. Um, I'm still learning myself. And yeah, with that, pretty much that's it. So basically, this game's all about building robots or Gundams and causing carnage. And this was the beast we built last time. I don't think anything's changed since then. Uh, basically, we've just added some better armaments. Uh, well, we also made him disabled by removing his legs, uh, but there's added bonuses. So each weapon has a different output, but let's uh, go straight into the hangar and launch straight into the mission. I'm only hoping I remember how to play this so quickly. Let's just read this. Uh, that's God. That's the EX action. Melee, boost, what's target? Switch options. Okay, yeah, I think I've got it. I think I've got it, guys. And there's our beast right there. Look at him, raring to go. And he's launching. There's speed on that. You've got to love the upbeat music in this. Alright. Got what kind of gun we got, so oh, yeah, it's the uh, Buster type rifle. And big guys are hard to take down. Oh, and I've got some moves. Boost tackle. I'm a big guy that has to hurt. What the hell's that thing got in the back? Oh, I want those double bazookas. If I can get those on my back. Of my guy. Because at the moment, all we've got is dinky little thrusters. Oh, we've just fallen. Alright, let's use... Whoa. <laughs> a gun packs a punch. Oh, wait. Alright, I've got to remember, look on the on-screen command prompts. I think I'm uh, screwing up a bit. Damn, it's coming in thick and fast. Let's see what other weapons we got. Head Vulcans, machine gun. Oh, we got an abdominal particle cannon. Right, how do we use that? I'm trying to remember how to use things. Oh, there we go. Here's the chest buster. trying to figure out why we don't have uh, our EX. Oh wait, I lost my arm. <laughs> wait, wait, what, what happened to targeting? 
damn it, I think I've forgotten some of the controls. Oh, wait, lock on. L1. Just remember that. The thrusters don't really last long. I've got you, mate. And get this big guy down. Alright, there's a guy on a surfboard. A flying surfboard. Wait, I'm going to get him. I've got a move. The chest buster. Maybe the gun. Oh God, he's hard. I'll go to him. Oh, I've just stolen it. Wait, it's manual targeting. I don't like this. Wait. Oh, this thing's hard to control. All right. Let's just... Wait. No, you better not go for it. Oh, wait. I just remembered. I just remembered something, guys. Super mode. Oh, I'm out of juice. But so far, there's so many of them. I've got to say, that super is lasting a while. Oh, got body part. Yeah, that super's taken a while to uh, turn off, but now it's off. <laughs> yeah. No, this game's a joy to play. I really got. I love. Really do love those um, button mashups, like uh, Dynasty style games. Oh, look at the range on that weapon. All right, it's going to let us advance. No, there's more of them coming. See, the intros are quite cool. How they come in, it's all angled, and you only discover what they are when they land. Look, that dude got a massive sword. I want that. What? My head's come off. My head's come off. Where's my head? <laughs> Whoa, these guys are wrecking me. Let's try. Let's try. Wait, wait, wait. Health, 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 health. Armor repair. Yep. I'm not letting you get up. I'm not letting you get up. Take you out. Yeah, your buddy's dead. I want that sword. I hope if I kick the crap out of him, he'll drop it. Oh, I missed it. I thought I could finish him off in the air. But we got him anyway. Yeah, she didn't really help much. I did most of the work. Shut up, Misa. No one's like she. Oh, I've got twin blades. Don't know what those are. I wonder what they look like. Okay, so let's quickly remember what the controls are. Uh, R1. Okay, that's the EX action. Okay, oh yeah. Okay, I'm remembering. Okay, time to ac access my... X mode. Damn, I, I remember the other missions being a lot easier than this. Alright, let's just keep our distance. Try not to lose any health. Oh, 
I'm going for this guy straight away. Stay down, big guy. Stay down. See, I think these are like uh, mini, not really mini bosses, but like group leader bosses. And then you got the actual main boss, those guys that kind of rock it down with their cooler looking modified Gundams. Yeah, it doesn't seem to have like multiple bars like the other guys. Let's see if I fire my chest. What? That was a clean hit. Alright, these guys, more guys up here. See, I don't think my chest thing is working out well. I might change to a machine gun. Oh, wait, that's got crap actually. I've got you, mate. All right. So far, just carnage. <laughs> so no real kind of strategy to this. Except for taking them out fast and quickly. Whoa, who did that? I'll see if I'll take him out for range. Stay down. These cars are so much more harder than the last mission. Oh, completely missed that uh, tackle. Oh, okay, so if I shoot it in a line, it goes through all of them. So, sorry guys, I am learning as I play along. But it's just so much going on on the screen. Really hard to keep track of it all. Let's go X mode. Take you out. Took his head off. <laughs> Chest beam. Get up close and personal with this guy. Ah, oh, crap. Where they're coming from this time. Whoa, those guns look like old school. Like the original series. Oh, I took this guy his head off. Yeah, see how much damage I can do with that. Oh yeah, I'm all over this guy. Oh, yes! Once you get hang of the combos, it's quite easy to do, guys. I've just got this one with all the cannons. Alright, I've got something called Granberry. Oh, and that's a one hit kill. Alright. So where to off? Okay, it looks like we're off to here. Um, oh yeah, I can command her to do stuff. Okay, yeah, I'm slowly remembering.
Oh wait, is that a Gundam Unicorn? I don't know. This looks big. Okay, I'm guessing that boost tackle can also help you escape dangerous situations. Okay, chest. Oh, that guy came out of nowhere. Look at the size of him. And you stay down. This is so much harder than the last levels. Okay. And, yep, done. Let's see what's in there. Nothing. Okay, cool. See, you can't even run or thrust long enough to actually get through the levels quicker. It would be nice if they gave you that, um, just for the fact. God, it takes a while to travel from one end of the map to the other. Oh, he's got a shield. Wait, there's one hidden one there. Stay down. Look at that whole sea of red on the radar. Must be ambushing, oh, uh, planning an ambush around the corner there. Let's see if I can start off with just beams. Nah, they're too well armed or armored. And just gang up on you and just bash you in the corner. I just ran in from nowhere trying to be a hero. I would like to see how this game plays online actually. I've not tried that yet and I will do so in the later videos. Um, but first off, we need to kind of build up this Gundam. I think this thing will be annihilated. Oh, cool. So we've got some command units here. Enemy player. I'm going to back off a bit, use gun. Probably go X mode as well. Amp up the damage a bit. Chest buster. I don't think he has any arms. <laughs> oh, this guy's taking a hammering. Awesome. And that's mission complete. Oh, look at my arm. It's absolutely fried. Looks like we took quite a bit of damage there. Okay, and uh, let's see what goodies we got. So we have a move called Shining Finger. 
and shiny finger sword. Okay, we'll see what that's all about in a sec. Uh, let's get to good bits. So the weapons. So we've got a couple of beam sabers. This one's from Wing. So that's guessing from the other series. Got a heat hawk. Not bad. Oh, cool. It's the uh, mace that the other guy was like fighting us with. And I think we got... Yeah, it's just double-edged sword, really. Oh, cool. So we got the buster rifle from uh, Gundam Wing. Definitely be using that. Uh, some double shotguns, I think. Some Zaku machine guns. A hyper bazooka. So we have a level four head. Oh, that looks cool. Body, let's see. Ah, uh, we've got the Shining Gundam body and the wing body. But the levels are quite low, so I'm not sure we're going to be using them just yet. Unless we have to do some of that merging stuff. Let's see what we have here. Legs. We've got the high mobility Gelgoog legs and the Gundam Grand type. And the back. Oh, we got something with a cannon. Awesome. Uh, just standard. Oh, wait. Double bazooka is awesome. We're going to be using that. All right, let's just take it all. How do I take it all? Uh, okay, obtain all and end. Awesome. So what we're going to do is customize our Gundam just before the next battle. And what we try and do here is just kind of give ourselves the most ultimate Gundam we can possibly make out of the trash we just collected. So on the right hand side, you're going to see some blue DPS, well, an arrow pointing to the right and saying it's blue, which just means that the damage is increased compared to what we're conventionally using. So at the moment, we've got this massive metal sword. Um, and it's time to move on from that, methinks. So we can either go hand to hand. Oh, I think we're going to use the Gundam Wing Beam Saber for this or Hammer. I uh, really want a Beam Saber, so yeah, I'm going uh, Space Jedi. Um, so let's see what we have here. Double shotgun. Not bad, not bad. Or the Zaku machine gun. Okay, so let me see if I can get more info about this and see what it is. So we've got this mega beam rifle that's kind of just like fires a burst of energy. But this thing does something else called a double spread shot. But to increase our DPS. Well, I hit something. Sorry, I hit the wrong button there. So I think we're going to go with... Yeah, we're going to go with the shotgun. But Oh, wait, there is a hyper bazooka option. Actually, let's just have the bazooka just in case. And let's see what heads give us better armor. Wait, there was something that gave us 41. Yep, yeah, we're going with that head. Nah. Like, like, like the, gun, the head we have at the moment looks so futuristic, so cool. Let's have a look at that bad boy. Look at that. Can't go wrong with it. Let's keep it. Okay, so now moving on to the body. Um, okay. <laughs> that means we can't have a head. Okay, so I'll see why that is that. See, the shining head gives us super mode. This one won't give us nothing except for a torpedo. I think we can live without that. But if we go with a camper body, we get no extras. But we get more armor, so let's just move on with that. And the arms. Oh, those arms look cool as hell. Oh, those arms look stupid. All right, we're going to go with the arms that look the most coolest, and that's the camphor. All right, now let's see if we can finally get some legs. Oh, wait. Let's we'll see what that gives us. Beam Naginata. Sorry, Beam Naginta or Naginata. 
let's say Naginata. So that gives us like a, a double-edged sword weapon uh, just from just equipping the legs, but it's not going to be incredibly powerful. Uh, it'll just probably be a standard base damage. But now we go to the backpack. So before we had this little dinky thing, and now we can finally get something that's cool. Let's see, uh, giant bazooka, giant bazooka. Oh, that beam cannon sounds awesome as well. Okay, let's go for the beam cannon. I'm, one, I'm curious. Because we've already got a bazooka on the arm. We don't need to go full hog. All right. Now, so let's see what we can actually equip as weapons. So, let's go with piercing slash. Cross slash. Yep, so I've equipped everything we possibly could. And that brings us on to paint. All right, so we want to keep that as is. Wow, it's looking incredibly red. Let's see what we... Actually, we should make the, uh, the inner bits white. The surface bits, I want to try and click keep to our kind of blue motif. Those red bits, keep them blue. We'll make those. Oh wait, our Gundam's head looks awful. Um, keep that, but... I want to change his head a bit. Go for the standard Gundam white. Right, a spit grey. All right, so that's that middle bit. Yeah, that looks cool. Um, traditional Gundam red. Sorry guys, don't blame me. Uh, I've got no style when it's a... I do have kits, but I tend to keep it standard. All right, so it kind of looks like a Gundam head on a completely otherwise worthless body. So, let's see what kind of poses we can give it, because obviously, now that we have legs, we could do some other cool poses. Let's see, uh, weapon, we can change a weapon. Nope, we wanna that. Change pose. Whoa, this guy has. Wow, that. That looks cool. Uh, stick with that. Let's change background a bit. Zoom in. Kind of twist them around. Beautiful. Okay, so how do I take this? Um, upload. About to slash something, so yeah, it looks cool as hell. All right, I'm not sure where it's actually uploading it to. Um, uploads it to a website, I think, where people can check your stats, but I haven't actually been to that website. And I'm not sure how to either, so. Let's move on to our second, well, no, it's going to be our fifth mission now. But all in all, the Gundam's looking great. I'm really happy the way it turned out, except for the colour scheme. If you guys got uh, no, sorry, <laughs> if you guys know a better colour scheme for our Gundam, um, let us know. Let's see if we can build something. And once again, if you do, if you do want to know how to get this game, I don't mind doing a quick tutorial. Just leave a comment, uh, or otherwise, I could just send you an email on how I managed to get this game. And yeah, and the uploading bit does take a while. Not quite sure why. 
is essentially, I'm just guessing, you're sending the information about your Gundam. Oh, wait, weren't able to connect to the server. That's fine. So let's just go to the hangar and select the next mission. And there you go, there's that beautiful new Gundam right there. Oh, wait, uh, this one's called Sand Rock Town Cup Qualifiers 2. So we're doing that. And we're deploying. So, okay. So we've got some new EX action, uh, well, attacks that we can actually now try. And here's our new beautiful Gundam. Look at that, sparkle. All right, so let's just jump straight into it, I'm guessing. All right, straight away, it's not going too well. Oh, awesome. Okay, let's see some of this. Oh, wow. That back cannon does pack a wallop. Where the hell is this last enemy? Oh, there they are. Hiding in a corner. I want to try out the... Uh, Okay. Heads come off. All right, time to use cannon. I forgot I got a bazooka. Straight away, we have Slice Broom Lucky's Butter. I think the music's on top of it. This guy is incredibly tough. Come on, guys. Yeah. One of the hardest things to do, guys, is switch a target in this game. Oh, this guy's trying to run away. What? 
Uh oh. Let's see what we get this time. Uh, just a couple of guys with axes. We got a lightsaber. Oh wait, that guy's coming apart. Just realized I lost my super. You know the booster thing that I had before? Yeah, I don't have that anymore, but hey. It's not the end of the world. Lost my arm. All right, let's move on to our ranged cannon. Oh, damage. What the hell? I lost my legs. Uh, got it back. These guys are a lot harder than they look. Wait, wait, wait. I just saw something. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Thought so. Alright, how do I fire? How do I fire? R2? Oh, it's a... Oh, cool. Shoots in a straight line. Got you. Okay, so I think I'm going to just stick to using this. Oh, wait, you could... Wait a minute, I think you could just crash into them. Yep, you could just ram them. Wait, I think I'm going to cheat my way through this uh, level. <laughs> oh, that's freaking epic. All charge at me, go on. Oh, awesome. So, what is that? Wait, I think I can hit my partner as well. Yep, I can. Okay, so I think the strategy is ram them, or oh, sorry, fire your beam, knock off their body parts, and just drive over them. Perfect hit and run. And let's run over that. Oh, come down, me, so you're still alive. And run over the bodies. Go right, Misa, you need to really get the fuck out of the way. Alright. So. Yeah, so far, smooth right. I don't think I've taken any damage whatsoever doing this. Oh, 
Uh oh. Okay, these guys look misses. Look like they mean business. So, <laughs> so let's see if we can use this to scam our way out of a win. Oh my god, there's a one-hit kill for the bosses. I want to see if I can save. Oh, just me, sir. You're just getting in the way. Oh, yeah. It's passed down and... Yeah. <laughs> uh, easiest boss battle yet. <laughs> so let's see if I can take this little... Uh, cheat with me. Or my little motorbike. Ah, oh, crap. Back to normal again, huh? mean business awesome Okay, those guys look cool, completely color coordinated, so they look professional. Oh, <laughs> shit. Oh, I've taken his arm off. Oh, God, they're double teaming me. Let's go. Okay. Ah, uh, got him. He's going with a beam Nagata. Awesome. Oh, that was a tough one. I wish we could have taken out little uh, hover motorbike. It's not really little if you think about it. These things are supposed to be the size of what? Three stories? Yeah, so. <laughs> okay, I still don't know what ace points do. I know what GP does. That lets us buy more Gundam parts. But we've got new moves. Oh, look at that rank go up. Okay, so we have Ground Shaker. And Multi Blast with our Bazooka. Let's see what we have here. So, the only good thing we have is the Heat Hawk, judging by the level. The rest of it is kind of trash that we already have. But this one's green, so I'm guessing that's going to be quite powerful. And we're finally starting to get some green items. Uh, I think the different colors represents how rare the item is. So, we've got a new beam rifle. And new, some new heads. Wow, we got some lot of parts on this one, or a lot of parts in this particular mission. I think that's better than what we currently have as well. And yeah, just more stuff really. Nothing incredibly cool. But we've got some shields and we definitely need a new shield. And of course we get plastic. What is that? Uh, not back resistance. Okay, let's just acquire it all. Since we've done all the work, yeah, we made it through uh, quarterfinals. Oh, 
より良い環境を選ぶのは当然だろう商店街のドノーマルなアセンブルシステムで上が目指せるかよ、まあ oh, This guy really has it in for us, d o n t he? Why does this T-shirt say good day? だったらその金と技術力が可能にするものを見せてやるよおいシンリーさっさと戻ってガンプラのセッティングしろって門松さんよあれ使うわやだ断るのかよもう単価切っちゃったから使わせてくれよ俺はな腕とかスピリッツ的な何かで頑張る感じが好きなんだよああいうの好みじゃないのタウンカップで使うもんじゃない勝つのが目的なんだからいいだろうあれじゃなきゃ本戦出ないからな<笑> What are they talking about? Use what? They got some sort of special weapon いいか金と技術力が可能にするものを見せてやるよさあ聞いたまもなく本戦を開始します予選通過チームは準備してください Okay, I had enough of that. So basically, it looks like we're entering the finals. And let's just quickly equip some of this new stuff. Oh, cool. The picture has changed. And look how cool the Gundam looks. Apologies for Alexa <laughs> ruining the、uh, Let's Play vid.、Um, yeah, I've got an Alexa Echo.、Uh, it does remind me of stuff I need to do.、Um, And sometimes it just randomly speaks. A bit scary there. All right, so let's see the actions. It's this. Let's go to assemble. All right. So, what do we have, what do we have currently equipped? We've got, okay, we've got the wing beam saber, but there is a better beam saber. And it's pink or purple. Alright, let's equip that because I definitely want to use that. Actually, if I merge. And we do it with this. See what happens. Awesome, so it did take the、um, ability enemy. Kill repair. So let's see what else I can merge this with. Kill enemy EX charge. Okay, we'll take that. So basically, what we do is merge items and absorb their abilities. And the rarer the item, the more stuff you get from it. So, if we do a. Will not take place. Okay. Let's find something with more abilities. So, there's nothing really with abilities. And yeah, so what we're going to do is stop doing that. Okay, so we've got, definitely got some new weapons here. So,、uh, Hyper Bazooka. This does more range damage, so I think I'll equip that. Let's see what abilities.、Uh, okay, so that induces. Nope, so nothing really. Good to actually do, so we're right there. So we got the Gundam G. That Gundam head is rarer or higher grade. Okay, I think what I'm gonna do is I do like this head,、um, so we're gonna merge that with one of the green ones. Machine gun DPS. Let's do that. Awesome, so it's got more stuff added to it. Let's 
and it, let's merge it again with the other. So it's got more stuff added to it. Awesome. Okay, and let's see, we've got a level four there. We also have that. So let's merge with that other piece that looks exactly like ours to add more durability. Okay, and moving on to the arms. How do I filter this? So let's uh, actually back. How do I? Okay, so we'll make salt keep should be rarity. Then by level. Followed by durability. Yeah, let's see what that does. Nope. By level. By rarity, by durability. Okay, so let's see what that does. So all our cool stuff should be at the top. So it's not too bad. Um, I'm going to pair merge this with the lesser item to bring up its rarity. And we added more stuff to it. Awesome. All right, same for the legs. So we've got this. Um, nothing really here to actually worry about, so I'm not going to bother. Actually, nah. No, no. It's only this thing. What is that actually? Let's see. It's a beam cannon. No, we're cool. Okay, cool. So, shield. We've been lacking a decent shield for a while. Oh, wow. That's a big shield, isn't it? Um, yeah, screw it. We'll take it. And we might have some new weapons. Or new abilities. Um, I want to try that Grand Shaker. That was an interesting uh, move there. Got a repair kit. Nice. Okay, I think I'm going to give ourselves another ability there. I'm going to take Mirage Shot. So remember that from the uh, last episode. That was an amazing ability. And give us that opportunity there. So guys, um, we are now hitting the hour mark. Um, that's the intended time I tried to keep these videos. But it looks like we made some progress because we're now in, I think we're in the finals. And um, yeah, well, if we continue doing the series, we get to see the end of the game and build a quite a cool Gundam. Uh, but before we actually uh, call it a day, um, so let me go back to the hangar. What I will do is show you the shop real quick uh, because this is actually where you get cool kind of pre-built models that you can take parts from to actually build a better Gundam. Um, yes, okay. So let's just see what we have unlocked. So we have a camphor and that's what we're currently using in terms of some of the parts. And if we go into confirm, I believe it's just confirming we have all the pieces for it. Uh, we're missing the beam rifle for that one. Uh, we're missing a lot of stuff for that one. But the dream is to actually find out what's at the bottom of that list. So, yeah, so that's pretty much it for this episode. Um, it's now time for the outro.
And there we have it. We finished a few missions, destroyed a shed load of Gundams, and had fun in the process. If you've got some builds or some tips that you want me to try out, let me know in the comments. I would really like to start talking about these unknown titles since it's kind of sad it never made it across the pond. Hopefully you noticed the quality of these videos also shot up. I'll be looking to put more animation and cool stuff like that. It just takes a bit of time learning software and you know, all good things come with uh, patience. So as I learn this, you'll probably notice a few new things I'm introducing to the videos. If you like what you saw, smash that like button. You can also follow me on Insta, Facebook, and Twitter. Links are in the description. And remember, game the clever way. Peace.